Hello there, friends and partners. This is Sergeant Sarah with Two Illuminate Ministries. It's time for another Mission Minute. This time, I want to talk to you a little bit about anacronyms. And so, anacronyms is just using a word and breaking it down, the first letter, and giving it a word or a phrase that represents that. And I just love those little things. Being an author, I really get into that kind of thing. And uh, for my whole life, I've always been really just interested in them and find it pretty easy to come up with, with an acronyms. And I remember one time when I was in Sunday school, in elementary school, we were learning the books of the New Testament. And my Sunday school teacher taught us an acronym for Galatians, Ephesians, Philippians, Colossians. So it was General Electric power company. I'm sure there's other variations of that around, but that's one. And then also when we were in school, we were learning the compass. And so for north, south, east, west, um, north, east, southwest, sorry, I think I said that wrong. It was never eat sour watermelon. <laughs> so those are just two that I remember that are just silly. But we've been doing something this year with one of my books. It's one of our best-selling books. It is the devotional book, and it's called Warrior Words. And you can get this on Amazon. We've been doing a, a devotional with that together. And I have a page in here that is an, an acronym that the Lord gave me. This is page 93. And it's of the word words. And so what it stands for, W-O-R-D-S, is words of the righteous destroy Satan. So you just remember words and you remember that God's words in your mouth are the words of the righteous and they destroy Satan, right? He tells us that we have the power of life and death in our tongue. I want to tell you, it's God's word in your mouth that is the only tool that you need to defeat the enemy. God's words. Jesus was tempted by the devil and he just spoke, get thee behind me, Satan. He just spoke his father's words, what he heard out of his mouth and he conquered the enemy in that moment who was coming against him. I heard something recently that I really liked that your words are containers and they contain life and death. They contain heaven or hell. In your mouth, the words that you speak are containing. So what you're speaking today is what you're living in in the future. So how you spoke last year is going to determine what this new year is for you. So friends, I challenge you, get God's words in your mouth. Start shooting them out of your mouth like ammo at your enemy. And remember the anacronym, the words of the righteous destroy Satan. And I want to give you a confession to say, I am a word warrior. I use the words of God out of my mouth and defeat the enemy. Thanks for joining me. This has been Sergeant Sarah with Two Illuminate Ministries for a Mission Minute.